journey into beach volleyball was actually pretty interesting. I, I used to be a professional baseball player, played baseball my whole life growing up, uh, through college and then the minor leagues for the Arizona Diamondbacks. Uh, when I got my release, I obviously didn't have much going on because I had just been uh, let go. So I went and lived with a buddy of mine down in South Carolina. Uh, there was a beach volleyball court about a quarter of a mile away. We, uh, we just bought the cheapest volleyball we could find and played as much as we could to just you know pass the time and have you know fun during the summer. And I just loved it more and more the more I played and I realized that it's something that I wanted to try to do and see how good I could get at this game. The professional beach volleyball circuit's basically all located out in California. So I decided to just put all my stuff in my car, uh, just, you know, $5,000 in the bank and drive across country, and, you know, find a place to live, find a job, you know, uh, and then I would just spend every day at the beach here in Huntington. Uh, I'd come down with my one ball and if somebody needed an extra guy, I would hop in and if nobody did, and I would run around on the court by myself and try to practice as much as possible. Uh, and eventually, you know, some of the you know better guys started to notice me and started to let me play with them. So, uh, you know, it's been a, it's been an interesting journey to say the least. And then come out here and be able to play in front of them and win it. You know, it's like I said, I love being able to come out and be able to perform well in front of my son and hopefully he'll remember some of these moments and do something as well.